We're with Jason Zerman to talk a little every men's basketball. Uh, coach, you're getting ready to uh, start the second half of UAA play, road uh, weekend, Chicago and Wash U. Yeah, we're uh, you know, going back on the road. Um, obviously, in the UAA schedule, this is the one where we go back to back. So uh, we played Chicago last Friday. Guys should be very uh, well informed about what they do and very familiar with them. So we're looking forward to competing on Friday night in Chicago. Uh, last weekend, tough weekend at home, a couple of setbacks. Uh, uncharacteristically, uh, a couple of cold shooting efforts by the Eagles. Yeah, you know, I, did, I thought we competed uh, and, and we're, we're better offensively on Sunday. I didn't think we were very good offensively on Friday night. And uh, Sunday we, we missed some shots uh, that we got some pretty good looks and missed some on Friday and, and we had to uh, compliment it. Chicago and Washington took us out of a lot of stuff that we, we usually get some easy baskets and they took us away from easy baskets too so gonna have to get some easy baskets this weekend uh, on the road and there are a couple stretches in both games uh, whether it be a four minute stretch a six minute stretch where we just didn't execute like we needed to down in, in a crucial time of the game. You know when uh, coming off a weekend like last weekend and you go on the road this weekend uh, have you found sometimes it's better to go on the road in a situation where, where you're coming off two losses? Yeah, you know, this year's our road schedule, I don't know if it's ever good to come off two losses. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> but this year our schedule on the road, you know, we've been tested on the road. Uh, you know, we went to Virginia early and had many road games early start the year. And, uh, our first UAA road trip uh, was, we had a pretty successful UAA road trip the first one. So, we're hoping to keep that uh, uh, rolling a little bit. But, you know, it's always difficult in our league to play on the road and on Friday night and then turn around Sunday. So, uh, guys are going to have to be tough about it and uh, figure out a way. You know, uh, something that almost got lost in the shuffle last week, it was Jake Davis uh, moving into the number two spot, uh, all-time leading scorer at Emory. Yeah, it's, it's you know, exciting for Jake. You know, he's been great for us for four years. Uh, he's, we talk about this a lot. He's been a staple, you know. He, he's going to, uh, you know, when he goes out there, what he's going to give you. And he can really, really score in a lot of different ways and really happy for him. And I know Jake would say this. He. He's not really concerned about scoring points as much as winning games. So I know last weekend hurt him as much as it hurt anybody. But uh, he, he's had a great career for us and is having a great career for us. We look forward to uh, the rest of the, this year with him. All right, Coach. Well, thanks very much for your time. We'll let you get rolling, and good luck this weekend. Thanks, Sean.